All right, here we go. The official start to the career. Turkleton Rodriguez, 5'5", 126. We're going to go ahead and get into the amateur tournament. Turkleton only knows one way to go, and that's go forward. Turkleton intends to be chest to chest, throwing them big boy body shots. Wear them down, beat them down, laugh at them. This doesn't normally translate to the to the amateurs. Yeah, get off me. Yeah, they don't know how to deal with that. Nah, ain't no space here. We fighting this in a phone booth, buddy. Nice little body head combo. Turkleton trying to get off. Uppercut to the head, then the jabs out to the body. You know how confident you got to be to jab out to the body? Wise man once said, don't hook with a hooker. And Turkleton is here for these hooks. Look at that man, stamina. You're going to wake up tomorrow like, mommy, my tummy hurt. Turkleton, a bully, big bully. shit out of Turkleton. Let's go. You might not get these knockouts in this amateur tournament. But he's gonna wear somebody out. He's gonna wear somebody out. It ain't even it ain't even a question of if. The first man he gotta face in the pros is just gonna get worn out. Pace. The pace Turkleton sets. Imagine somebody hit you 65 times, 84 times in two and a half minutes. You not built for that. And jabbing out on top of it all. Turkleton miss with the big joint. Even though there's no real benefit to it, Turkleton swinging for the fences, boy. Boy is not is no joke. No joke. Turkleton, he's gonna be a problem. He's gonna be a problem. Problem. I would not want to deal with Turkleton. He ready already. Oh no! I think we missed the last fight. Doesn't matter. Turkleton hit a man a lot, a lot, a lot. That's it. That's all that happened. Turkleton said, "I'm gonna hit you a lot. Are you ready?" Another dude was like, "No." Uh-uh, we're not stepping back. And he's smaller than us? Uh-uh, you finna be on the ropes the whole time. Keep it tight, keep it tight. 
He was way more defensive than the other kid was. But some of it is getting through nonetheless, buddy. You can't win if you don't throw. You heard Turkleton's corner talking about forward. Nah, we're going to put him right on the ropes. He keeps turning him. Turkleton's chasing him, not cutting off the ring. Turkleton beat him to this punch that time, but... He's not going to give us no fireworks. He is in a shell. Yeah, we'll eat one to give you four. Circle into his left to, to try and get out of these corners. A nice left hand by him. But yeah, no, we just couldn't keep cornering him. Stalk him out and chalk him out. Let's go. You scared to go to church, baby boy, because we finna hit you. Every time he opens up, Turkleton's like, oh, your hands moved? Here's four. Ooh, he got him. Yeah, nah, Turkleton is all pressure, all pressure, all fight, all the time. Oh, a nice jumping, leaping hook from my man's here. He finally woke up, but it's too late. Turkleton now just trying to do damage. Then in case I see you again, I want to leave you something to remember me by. Turkleton just pressure, pressure, pressure. Landed more punches than that man threw. That's crazy. That's crazy right there. Crazy work. All right, here we go. One more. Go ahead and win this amateur division and get Turkleton his first pro fight. Four. This one is expected to be a thriller. 
when you list all the intangibles, topping that list is what he has. Hernandez is without a loss in his career. Yeah, that zero means that he just hasn't learned how to do that, how to lose. And he doesn't want to begin tonight. And he returns on that exchange. Janito's ability to punch, to flat out put forth power, puts people in the seats. Early on, that's what they expect to see here. And early on, Urkelton just cornered him and said, okay. It can be dangerous, it can backfire. If he lands a punch and it doesn't get rid of the guy, well, what else can he do? What happens then? Gotta try to do better than that. He missed with that hook. Close the distance. All right, do that again. Mm -mm. You're not letting him off the hook. Uh-uh. Back on them ropes, buddy. It's a big right hand, but... The favors return. Turkleton, oh my god. And forth they go, each man getting the best of it. Good clean shot, returning fire. Well done by Hernandez. Oh, he got that one in. Mm-hmm. No, no. We walk him out and chalk him out. You do have four rounds, so. Teddy, what would you recommend based on what we're seeing here? Tonight? Well, two aspirin and then go. Oh, no. Actually, I would say a little counter punching would be just what the doctor ordered. That's a better prescription for him. Junito's putting his punches together. All right, we'll take a three punch combo to the head. Like my guy. It was a nice weave and we missed the counter, but it's okay. And now just wasting away some time with that clinch. Pressure's just too much for him. Another flush shot to the head. Turn the sender with the left hand. That's great. Just breaking them down. Fires one right back after taking one. Like, nah, buddy. The word by Hernandez. Immediately. Under the jab and to the body. Get off me. Nice block that time. It was intended mm -hmm. to the head. Ooh, nice counter by him. His mark there going upstairs. Hernandez's blocking ability is doing well for him there. A snapping combination by Rodriguez. Good work defensively by Junito. Plus, he landed that counter punch. He will not give me anything to work with. He's so scared. And then he timed them beautifully. Hernandez's inability to get away from his opponent's left hand is so evident. And it's going to stay that way if he doesn't change something. The upstairs left hook to the downstairs work. Away from that part. Uh -huh, the uppercut got through. If you block in front of your face, but you lean your head back, there's space for the uppercut to get in under your hands. That's for all you young boxers out there. Oh, we throwing big shots? Yeah, no, you don't want it. You don't want it. So scared. I like that, though. I like that he said it's the fourth round and I'm losing. I need to throw the big stuff. I love the heart. It's not going to matter, though. Woo. Maybe. All right, we got to watch for that big right uppercut. He's looking for it now. 
So you can get one of mine. What a great job. He gave one right back. Give him the big right hook too. And the left to go with it. Take two of these and call me in the morning. Big left hook to the body. What? Oh, I thought we was throwing. What happened? Your hands was moving a minute ago. What happened? Baby boy, what happened? Where'd that uppercut go? Where'd all that? That gusto. You had hard a minute ago. Oh, did I? You realize I ain't going nowhere? Mm hmm. Woo! That last one had some intent on it as well. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Imagine getting hit. 150 times <laughs> like I said that's that feels so bad all right here we go we got circleton in the gym at home in Brooklyn working on them uppercuts that's all we about we about them uppercuts and them hooks we just want to get inside and bang it out What your daddy said to your mama. Just want to get inside and bang it out. Now you're here. A good transition. You see, everything's boosting. He's going to be pretty strong. But we really just want to make sure we have some good endurance. Make sure we're good to go. Another round. Same thing. We just want to build up our endurance right now. Circle is going to hurt. Do not want to be on the receiving end of none of that. And I know a lot of people think, oh, well, you know, he weighs 126 pounds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I dare you go to your little local boxing gym and ask them to put you in with a 126 pounder and see what happened. See what happened. You get in with the local featherweight. They don't even got to be a champ. Just the dude who trained four days a week, five days a week, six days a week. Going to whoop your ass. And I'd be willing to bet money. People always overestimate how tough they are or how much they can fight compared to like trained fighters. Uh uh, nah, buddy. That boy gonna whoop D Dog shit out of you. You gonna go home with a bloody nose, a busted lip, and a story. All right, didn't quite get 50,000. That's not what we wanted, but we got 40,000. It's, it's some. We Again, we gotta improve our speed. Our speed's not where it needs to be, but it'll get there. And then we're just going to take two weeks of rest. We're not doing nothing else. We're not focused on nothing. We just need to get in here. And beat the brakes off this man. Should be an easy fight for Turkleton. Joppy is uh, actually smaller than Turkleton in a lot of ways. Well, they've been waiting for this moment, and now they get it. Round one underway. Janito's showing you what it takes to be the best in this business. Good, crisp combos. Unable to make an impact there by Juanito. Blocks the headshot. And now that backhand, the straight left hand, scores well for him. And now a little combination punching, landing both shots. You see, my man is not goofing, though. Got a guy in here tonight who loves to throw the uppercut. That means we have an opponent against him who has to really be conscious of his defensive posture. Yeah, it's kind of like parking your car. You know, you don't want to park near any fire hydrants. You're going to get a ticket. You want to leave your head right in the middle. You're not going to get a ticket. We forgot to see what we could upgrade after our training. 
left hand to the head. Well, supposed to be fighting, but instead he's hugging. Halfway through round number one. He's going to bank away this body work. If you give me the good chance, I'm going to take it, though. Targeting that straight left hand. Hey, keep your hands up. That was a fine block by Junito. Ooh, you don't want to eat those. Unable to connect by Rodriguez. Junito's putting forth. Yeah, he's already wearing down. We got him. Just keep that pressure on him. Tucks those elbows in, blocks the body shot. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, he came out like he was on throw, but then the pressure just pressure. Oh yeah, it's gonna be a left hook that's gonna get him in the end. It's gonna be a left hook that's gonna get him in the end. What you reaching for? You can already see his stamina going down. He's going to keep banging that drum. Comes with the right. Good one, too, by Junito. Ooh. Beat us to the punch, but not the second one. He tried to hook back. Caught us right there. Janito's work in training camp is now paying off. Do you see the accuracy? In the He's getting the lead leg outside. Good block there by Rodriguez. Stay away from those. Ooh. Rodriguez is showing that he's got some defense of his own. He got away from that punch. He's doing some great in and out work. He's actually made some good adjustments because I can't get him now. There it goes. He's been having great success with these combinations, Teddy. Well, there's a reason for it. He's using his jab to trade him. And then he's letting the punch go, letting the hands follow. Well off the mark by Junito. Nah, you nah, you can say it's off the mark all you want. He took that left hook to the body. He know what happened. Three minutes gone by. He know what it felt like. Rodriguez's ability to get to his man paid off well there. He damaged him in that round. He's just giving me the right hand to the body. I'm going to take it. He tried to nab him uh -huh. up top, but was unable to connect. Zones Woo. on that overhand right. Come on, buddy. He's committed to that jab, and he doesn't just throw one out there, but brings the second one immediately behind it. Comes right back with some offense of his own. Uh huh. Of the border, and the ref gives him the warning. Who hit low? Was it me? Defensively by Hunito. Plus, he landed that counter punch. Yeah, and he forced him to punch. He made him. He threw it out of him. He's wearing down. You see his stamina. Every time he throws, we just stab him to the butt. Stab him to the gut. Everybody missed. Halfway through this round here, carries that punch away. 
A little sloppy. Teddy, there are opportunities that are here for him, aren't there? Yeah, counter punch opportunities because he's got an opponent who's walking in a little bit. Now he has a chance to start to chuck something back at him a little. Mmm. That don't tickle. That right hand to the body on a southpaw, it don't tickle. Targeting that belt line with the double jab. He returns the favor with a right hand of his own. Rodriguez is putting forth that hard work he did in training camp there, landing a crisp combination. Yeah, no, we go wear him down. Of oh, the fourth round, he going night night. Last ten seconds of round number three. Woo! You don't want to eat those. You don't want to eat those. Keep it up. Keep it up. He's been on target with his attack. Good, accurate punching as we begin round number four here, and he's up three to zip on your scorecard, Teddy. Good counter punching, and when you're counter punching the right way. You're usually getting clean shots. He's getting them. Boy, sharp two-punch combination by Junito. And he just yeah, no, you there. you got yours in, but I got mine in. And then commits to giving one right back. Teddy, he's just covering up. That's all he's doing, but it gives his opponent so much time to pick where he isn't. Yeah, you're right, Joe. I mean... First of all, some of them are going to get through and some of them will watch them. They're getting through. And you just touched on it. I mean, you come up, you tell your opponent, hey, I'm camping out. I'm not throwing uh -huh. back. So instead of throwing one or two at you, he's throwing combinations of three, four, five. You got a problem. Nice work. Great technique. The combo lands. Halfway through round number four. Yeah, no. Janito's the target of a hook. All right, he's taking over the middle portion of the. Oh, yep, there it go. There he lands the right hand well. He is stunned there, and now he ties up. He ties up. That right hand to the body. The other guy that he allowed himself to get grabbed. Oh, Woo! Uh-uh. That overhand right said, excuse me, sir. You look real sleepy. Let's take a nap. Get you a little rest. Oh, no. If he survives, then he better figure out why he was put on the floor. Wait a block there. Told you the body work gonna wear him out. Not able to land the headshot. There's the combo downstairs. I can imagine throughout your career you've been all over mm. the fighters for lack of time. All right, let's go finish him. Let's go finish him right here. To wonder, does he want to win the fight? That's what you start to wonder. Janito's the kind of boxer that wants to do just that. Find the target, get the combination working, land both punches. Nah, no, no, no. We just got to make sure we don't punch ourselves out trying to finish him. Off to the side, a little swing and a miss going upstairs. That worked out really well, throwing off the right hand after getting tagged like that. Our punches are slowing down. We just got to mm -hmm. answer him. Sends the combination to the body. He 
Look at the heart on this man, though. I say that. He's got heart. No stamina, but got heart. Oh, a good right hand by Juanito. Rodriguez is getting the job done with hooks on the end. Woo! Stepped in with the step right into the right hand. Hit him in the where did hit him right there where the chin meets the ear. Look at that. Show the replay again. Oh, they won't show it again. It's okay. Nah, buddy. Just go ahead. Take your time. Wow. The hard on this man. Let me tell you what. That's one of the reasons he got off. Oh, and he returns fire with a left hand. Check it out, Blair. Ten seconds to go in this round. Missed the body shot. Ooh, you don't want to take one of those, though. But he's not going away. Tell you, it's not because he ate a lot of carrots when he was a kid and he has real good eyesight. It's because he's calm, he has good technique, and that is why he's right on the mark. Janito's movement helped out there. He avoided that punch. Good double jab by Junito. Rodriguez has got to be really careful there, Teddy. I mean, he's leaving himself wide open. And what's going to happen next? See, you know, he's leaving himself open. He hasn't paid for anything yet, but that will be coming before you know it. <laughs> Tried to land that upstairs and was off the mark. <laughs> Cut down that ring and just push his opponent against the ropes. This man has heart. Tell you what, he's got no stamina left. Been knocked down twice, still throwing. Made out of Snapples, just the best stuff on earth. Jesus. He just missed that shot up top. Bro. Go down. I need the knockout. My corner calling for the uppercut. There it go. Janito's starting to score at ease against his opponent there. Anytime you can land a three punch combination, you're really hitting your group. I can't believe he made it to the final bell. What a warrior. Wow. What a warrior. He lost every round but one on all the scorecards, but next time these judges judge a fight kind of like on a pack of cigarettes, you know. He said, I will finish my fight on my feet. Absolutely impressive. Absolutely impressive. Let's go ahead before we forget that we're one and oh. We're still just a prospect. But we're actually gonna upgrade our fighter before we forget. Uh, I guess we can't really upgrade a lot. Actually, if we can get left hook to the body, we landed a lot of those. All right. But yeah, 1-0. Perkleton Rodriguez. We rolling.